Hey guys, welcome back to Colson's Critters. I'm Colson Smith, and today we're going to be doing the um, Q&A video, which you guys uh, gave me questions for. And we're also going to be doing the giveaway, so make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video to see the giveaway. The winner will be announced, and I will text you on Instagram, and I'll set it up. So let's get to it. Alright, the first question is, um, is there any animal you don't want... Never mind. Is there any animal you want to own that you currently don't? Uh, I've always wanted a panther chameleon, and I've never had one before, and I really want one. Or a um, gargoyle gecko, which would be pretty cool. Alright, next question. Do you plan to make YouTube a car your career? Uh, I Right now, I'm kind of just doing YouTube for fun, and to tell you guys how I take care of my animals. And I'm kind of just giving a like videos just to share with you guys. I'm doing it for fun. Maybe one day I'll make it into a career. Um, have you kept many lizards? Which species is your favorite? I've only ever had crusted geckos, leopard geckos, and a chameleon before. I had a veiled chameleon. I had three in total. Um, my favorite would probably be the crusted gecko just because they're super easy to care for and they have a lot of personality and I just really like them. Uh, what's your favorite aqua aquatic flora and what's the best way to take care of it? Uh, I don't really take care of any aquatic flora. I've had water lettuce and it's pretty easy. You just put it in the water and, and uh, I just have it in my pond in my backyard and it grows like crazy. Would you ever consider keeping any non-water snails? For example, giant land snails or garden snails? Um, probably not. I uh, don't really have space for snails and I don't really think I would ever keep them what's what's an animal you hope to get in the future like I said earlier a panther chameleon or a gargoyle gecko I, I'd also get a bunch of other animals if I had the choice but uh, yeah I don't really have money so there's that um, how was your day uh, it was pretty good I had a lot of homework today which kind of sucked but um, other than that it's pretty good uh, next question is on my YouTube on the community page so do you plan on getting more animals and if yes then what animals um, I'm thinking I'm gonna get a gargoyle gecko soon a panther chameleon is really expensive so I don't think I'll ever get one of those and I want an axolotl if you had to choose between to have a bunny or a lobster as a pet which would you choose for those of you who don't know I actually haven't showed them on my YouTube channel yet I actually have bunnies uh, I used to have 21 at one point, um, but we sold a bunch and a few passed away, so we only have one left. Um, he's in the cage over there. I'll show him later in the video. Um, his name's Oreo. I've had him the longest. He's like, I think he's seven years old, eight. I'm not really sure. He's an old, old bunny, but I'll show him later in the video. How did you get all your animals? Do you work at a pet store or something? Also, how old are you? Um, I got all my animals through either me buying them I got my crusty gecko William for Christmas once my other crusty gecko I bought my leopard gecko I bought and I just buy a lot of my animals just because I like the animals a lot um, some most of the animals I, or some of the animals I have are from my dad getting them for me or he just had fish and then he didn't want them anymore so he gave them to me also, I do not work at a pet store, and I'm 15 years old. Why did you start YouTube? Also, you're very good at it, so keep up the great work. Thank you. Um, I started YouTube because I wanted to share all my like animals and just everything with you guys. And um, my cousin Ethan was doing it, so I thought it'd be really fun. So I decided to do it. When did your passion for animals begin? Like, did you get a betta fish when you were young and everything just clicked? Or was it something that took time to build up? Um, I did, I think my first animal was probably a betta fish. And um, I, I loved animals in general. Every time we would go to a zoo or a pet store, I just always loved animals. Um, what animal would you recommend for first time pet owners and which animals wouldn't you recommend? Uh, Crested gecko, great first animal. Um, I had, I got my first one when I was like 12 or something, but they're super easy to care for. Uh, you just need, you don't need much space and it's super easy to care for. 
Uh, I wouldn't recommend getting a chameleon because I got one when I was like 10. I had two of them, but the pet store didn't tell me how to take care of them, and I was I was super young, and I didn't really know much much about animals, so um, I would not recommend getting those as a first time pet. What is your favorite animal and why? Uh, don't really have a favorite animal. Um, yeah, I just don't really have a favorite animal. Um, has Ethan ever given you any tips about YouTube and what is it like having him as a successful YouTuber and cousin? Do you hope that one day you'll be as successful as him or maybe even more successful? Um, I, Ethan lives in a different state than me, so I don't really see him much. But to me, he's just my cousin. So when people say like he's a famous YouTuber, I, it's like weird just because he's my cousin. And I like, uh, he doesn't. He's not famous to me because he, I know him. Well. But uh, yeah, Ethan's great. I love him. Um, I I do hope I'll be as successful as him once. But I don't think I'll ever get more successful than him. Two questions: What got you into animals? Have you watched? Ethan in the Unis Anus videos, and if so, what are your thoughts? Um, what got me into animals? Basically, my dad. My dad had a 300-gallon um, reef tank in our old house, and I always loved to sit by his tank and watch the fish. And I was like, um, like five years old when that when he had that. So uh, I would always just sit in the chair and watch the fish swim by, and I loved them. Um, I've actually never seen Unis Anus videos, so. I got enough thoughts on that because I haven't seen them. Uh, what was the first animal you remember having? Um, beta fish. That's the first one I remember having. I mean, like, that I got to keep by myself. My dad also obviously had the 300 gallon tank. But... Do you plan to get animals other than fish and reptiles? If so, what are you thinking about getting? If not, why? Um, I have two dogs and I have a bunny. So those aren't fish or reptiles, but if I had to get another animal that's not a fish or reptile, I honestly don't know. Um, I, I don't know. If you have any suggestions for an animal I should get, leave it in the comments below. Have you been inspired to take on YouTube career, if not videos? What is your dream job and end goal? Um, I honestly don't know yet. I'm only 15, so I haven't really like thought about it yet, but I definitely want to try YouTube out and uh, maybe work at a fish store one day or saltwater fish store open my own first off I love the content second I have a few questions one how do you afford all the supplies and tanks two are you in college or working and if you work what job do you do I'm sorry if this is personal I don't mean to intrude um, uh, I I afford all my animals just because a lot of them I get for free or I just save up my money over time. Uh, also, my, I work at my dad's store every now and then. He pays me to clean and work there. So I get money from him. And um, I'm not in college or working. I mean, technically I work at my dad's store. But I'm not in college. I'm only 15. And, um, yeah. Do you plan on making even bigger enclosures or getting more animals? I love seeing your critters. They're all so cute. Um, I do plan on getting bigger animals and enclosures, hopefully. I don't know what animals yet, but I really want to. I watch Paul Caffaro's videos all the time, and uh, he gets like all these new animals, and I really want to have that one day. What started your love for animals, and what age were you when you got your first animal? And second question, why are you so adorable? Um, I started my love for animals when I was really little. Um, my dad had the 300-gallon reef tank, so... And why am I so adorable? Um, thank you, and I give all credit to my mom. Love you, mom. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna go show you guys the, um, those were all the questions. I'm gonna go show you all the bunnies, so let's get to it. Um, we, my dad actually built this. This is him, this is Oreo. He's a guy. Um, this centerpiece in the middle, like right there, there's two of them, two panels, and this rope, you can pull on it and it lifts them up or you can lower it. Right now I have it up because um, it's just him, so he can have the whole cage to himself. But if we have females, you can put females on one side and males on the other. Um, 
he is very old, but um, there's his water and there are some pellets on the other side. Feed him Timothy hay and you just fill his water every day, clean it out. And this is his cage, so it's got a little lock system on here. And if you go back in there, this is his little hideout. There's one on the other side as well. And there's a screen on this side for when they're pooping. It'll go through the screen. And then this side for bedding for him to um, hide in and walk on. Uh, he hides in the back over there and we put this tarp up. So when it rains, the rain will, he can get back in this little hideout and not get rained on. So that's him. All right, we're gonna do the giveaway now. So let's get to it. All right, guys, so now we're gonna be doing the giveaway. All I have is a list of people on a piece of paper that enter the giveaway. There are 22 of you. Um, so I'm gonna say to Siri to pick a number between one through 22 and that'll choose the winner. Here's the list. Hey Siri, pick a number between one and 22. A random number between one and 22 is seven. All right, Caitlin Steger, you are the winner. Congratulations. So I'm gonna be putting your comment right here and I'll be messaging you, messaging you on Instagram. So just stay tuned. Guys, that wraps up today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please smash the like button. Let's see if we can get to 200 likes on this video. Also, um, if you're new here, please consider subscribing. Um, and thank you so much for the support recently. We just hit 5.5K, which is amazing. So thank you guys so much. All right, till next time, peace.